Hey everybody, it's Mark again, and uh, I'm at a friend's house, and we're working on this particular cuckoo clock that has a little man that comes out on this door, and a cuckoo that comes out on this door, and it's a beer drinker cuckoo clock, but the uh, movement is for the music box is set up differently from your typical beer, bo uh, beer drinker cuckoo clocks where the music box is up in the top of the case. On this one, it's on the side of the case. Go ahead and turn that around, Ron. And I just wanted to create this video to show you how this works. This lever right here is what turns the little man and makes him go outside the door and when he's when the music is done this lever goes into the mouth of this cam and uh he comes back inside the door this is a side mounted music box and so they're differently uh, than uh, your typical music box so um in this particular case, I got to take the music box back out to adjust the cam because when the music is done, he's still outside his door. So I have to adjust the cam to line up um, the B or the mouth of the cam with this uh, wire here. And I'm going to see if I can show you that wire you should be able to see that wire coming in and out of the cam right there so um, if your little man is staying out when the music is done you have to take the music box out and I'm fixing to do that and I'm going to show you that, so stand by. So what I have to do is loosen this screw right here. And turn this wheel. It's a trial and error thing. I'm going to loosen the screw. I'm going to turn the wheel. I'm going to tighten it up. And then I'm going to put it back into the music box. Ron, will you um, put this thing upright? And go ahead and sit it on the table here. And make sure they'll push the little man back inside. He's in. And so here I am putting the music box back in to make sure that that wire is in the mouth of the movement in a slot where I want it to be. I'm going to adjust it just a little bit more because right now it's just barely into the B of that cam. So I'm going to adjust it a little bit more so it's more into the B of the cam. Because right now that wire is hitting right here and I want it to hit in this area here. So I'm just going to adjust it a little bit more. Hopefully. And try it again. And then uh, see what it looks like. And then if I'm happy with that, I'm going to tighten the music box down and test it out. And I think I need three people to, uh, to do all this. I'm pretty happy with that. I'm going to uh, uh, put a screw or two in the music box and then try it out. So stand by. Now these screws are only in here temporarily because I have to uh, pull the 
music back out to adjust this wheel right here. That way it hits the beer drinker. Um, is it the beer drinkers or the... Yeah, there's two beer drinkers. Uh, so, but it's not hitting that cam, so I got to pull this back out. But I was, was wanting to show you the music itself. The um, little man should be coming out right now. Yep. Yep, he's all the way Which up. he is. You want to hold that, Ron? Uh, at the, and when the music is done playing, now this is a one-day cuckoo clock, so the music plays twice. Perfect. And the little man comes back in. And so now, the uh, little man should be out. Yep. Perfect. And when the music is done playing, perfect. Love. And this is on a. Um, I don't know the maker, but this is a regular twenty-five movement, and like I said, it has the beer drinkers, and the little man, and the cuckoo clock. And stand by, I'm going to show you another movement. Now, this is the Oompa players with the uh, water wheels. And if, if um, this particular one has a different style of... Can you give me a, a screwdriver or something, Ron, so I can point one? Thanks. This one has a different style of music box. Even though it's side-mounted... The, the lever here activates the little man that comes out and the cam when he's done the um, when he's done doing his thing the uh, the lever here will go into the the notch of the of the great wheel that's part of the movement anyway i hope this video helps you know you uh, do youtube searches to try to help you with the clock most of the time you don't find them and that's why i create these videos you know this is the first time that i've worked on a uh, cuckoo clock that has the side mount here with the little man like the, I showed you in the first part of the video I had to figure out what to do with it anyway don't forget to hit that subscribe button and God bless